welcome back to another video. Today we're back with another match day vlog. This time is Swansea City versus Blackpool in the Skybit Championship. 7:45 p.m. kickoff today at the Swansea.com Stadium. So it's been a while since we've had a midweek um, midweek game under the lights. Uh, I think the last time was Bristol um, in the cup, but it's been a long time since we've had a league um, game under the lights, uh, especially at home as well. So um, that'll be a good one. Um, we're desperate of you know three points. Martin's under real pressure, but. I hope we can get a win, I hope we can get the three points and I'll catch up to you when I'm with Luke and the boys and see what they think ahead of the game. Right, so outside the ground now we've got the team lined up. Andy Fisher, Nathan Wood, Ben Cabango, Harry Darley, Matty Sorinola, Jay Fulton, Matt Grimes, Ryan Manning, Ollie Cooper, Luke Cundall and Joel Perot and then Luke will give you the bench. On the bench we've got Lewis Webb, Joe Allen, Olivia Chan, Morgan Wirti, Curly, Cullen, Joel Atterbill, Jen and Liam Walsh. And Ben Hughes. Right, Bish, got the microphone a few minutes. That's right. What's the score prediction? 1-0 Blackpool, Jerry Yates. They've had 1-13 league big. games. We've won 2-16, so... What the fuck? Yeah, exactly, what the fuck? Big ass with his watch. fucking head. Jerry Yates. Fucking <laughs> hell. Right. Marley, like bloody vlogs. What's your prediction? Hello, me fucking laddies. 2-1 uh, Swans. Uh, Morgan Whittaker and Harry Darlin. Uh, for Blackpool, Morgan Rogers, three chains in the side though. Like, I get the, I get the, I get that Harry Darling's a crucial player to us, but why play five at the back against a side that's 24th in the league? Yeah, that's true. Yeah, um, but all known, so I trust Martin to get the job done, and uh, yeah, hopefully we can get the three points for the first time in fuck knows how long. But big ass with his head. <laughs> Morgan be Jolly Rogers. Uh, what is your prediction? I. Well, five at the back end bottom league and two wins in 16 games. Really don't know what to think of this, but I think we will scrape a 2 1 victory, though. I think Joe Perot and Harry Darling will get our goals, and for Blackpool, I think I'll go with Josh Bowler. Yeah, I don't want to show the 
Yeah, we've definitely been the more dominant side, but we just need to, you know, make it count, get a few more goals. You know, we never see three times, but we, we, we never kill the game off. We need, we need a second goal and possibly a third, because we're definitely capable of it. Man sent off Blackpool. I believe his child with the team well. Second yellow. Yeah, got a man advantage now. <laughs> Shoot. substitution for scores is 31st in the April field, number 31. Oli Cooper. Oli being replaced by the Swans number 10, Olivier Isham. Second sub for the Swans in the field, number 4, Jimmy Fulton. Jay being replaced by Swansea City's number seven, Joe Allen! Second half, it, it was a bit of a team, creating a lot more chances. 
But I think in the end, we definitely deserved to win. We had plenty of chances in the first half to carry the game. But uh, yeah, we only won 2-1. It's like an own goal for us to win the game just to get fast against the team that bothered the league. And the sending off as well. Yeah, yeah, but, yeah, but fair play to all of that. We've a long journey on our way to the night. Fair play to all of you that travelled. But yeah, good win for us again. Yeah, I'd say it's probably the least convincing win of the season, but three points is three points at the end of the day. It was very much needed. Obviously, a massive thanks for watching this, and we will be back Friday night for our match preview ahead of Black Men Away, so stay tuned for that. Thanks for watching.